Welcome back 544. Today we continue our commitment to helping people affected by Harvey with our taking action for Texas phone bank. 7 Action News reporter Matthew Smith is live for us this morning. Now Matt, we're looking to keep this momentum going today, right? Yeah, and that's important because yesterday alone we raised more than $30,000 through this effort here inside the station, teaming up with the American Red Cross of Michigan, of course, and you guys can help out. In fact, we got the phone banks ready. We're going to be starting to take your calls. I actually have already gotten a few phone calls just from us talking about how we're opening the lines beginning at 6 a.m. today. All you're going to have to do starting at 6, call 248 827-3362. By the way, you can also text the word Harvey to 90999. That'll give a $10 donation to the American Red Cross as well. Meanwhile, we are finding locals helping in other ways as well. The TLC Animal Rescue in Milford has already saved, get this, more than 150 dogs from flood ravaged areas in Montgomery, Texas. They've been picking up animals to bring to our state for a new start. And we're told there's many other groups already rolling up their sleeves and chipping in as well. We're hoping that we're going to be able to help them with placement of some of the smaller uh, puppies in our shelter. We have room for those kinds of things right now, and by the time they get back, we may have room for some larger dogs when they make another trip down there. Ooh, they, too, are taking supplies through donations. The people that you just heard from, that's the Humane Society of Macomb. We have a complete list of all the needs that the groups that are helping out need right now. That's down there in Texas. And, well, if you just want to help out, you can head on over to our website, WXYZ.com, to figure things out. Taking action for Texas, the telethon going to be kicking off at 6 a.m. These are the phones that our volunteers, as well as the American Red Cross volunteers, are going to be helping out. In fact, we've already got the donation forms ready. And as I said earlier, we've already had a few people, really generous people, calling in even before we've opened up the phone line. So make sure you make that mark that number down and pick up the phone and call beginning at 6 a.m today. Again, that is 248-827-3362. We'll have people standing by to help out. We're live inside the call center this morning. Matthew Smith, 7 Action News. Yeah, thanks, Matthews.